Okay, welcome everybody. We're looking today at the address management model in uh, Esri's local government information model, and we're uh, going to look at how to change the name of a road here. And in order to do this, uh, first I'm going to select the road I'm interested in, and over here under full road name, I'm going to attempt to change the name of that, and we're going to call it James Drive. And what you'll notice is it's going to give me an error. It's going to say attribute update and it cannot be changed. That is because it is listed. We have to have all our road names listed in a master street list in a table. And we'll go look at that table right now. It's called master street name. And I'm going to open up that table. And if we go to the very end of the table, we're going to tab well, We're going to go ahead and add this new road name that we're interested in. I'm going to call it James Drive. And now what we'll see is as we go back and we attempt to put that in here, now it should recognize that for us and it will go ahead and change that road name. And the reason for the master street name table is to have one listing of each road name in there so they're unique. That way we don't uh, duplicate or rename any roads. Uh, to keep them as unique identifiers. Um, so you won't, you'll want to remember to go ahead and update your address points as well. Those need to reflect the name of the road in them as well. So you'll need to update those and you could use Attribute Assistant to do that as well if you wanted to. So for more information, uh, please visit our website, cloudpointgeo.com. And for videos, uh, it's forward slash videos. Thank you very much.